InFlight is a system that lets you add PeopleSoft content into a SharePoint page as a web part. The advantages of pairing these two systems include seamless single sign-on and the ability to partner PeopleSoft's extensive UI with document libraries, lists, and other relevant content from SharePoint. This creates a richer and more streamlined end-user experience. Let's take a look. We've divided our sample SharePoint portal into an employee section and a manager section. For this demo, we'll visit the manager portal. Here, we've included some HR policies and guidelines, as well as quick links to the most commonly used content. To make this page more useful for managers, we're going to add PeopleSoft's work list onto this page to display any approvals or other administrative tasks that this manager might have outstanding. To do that, we edit the SharePoint page and add a web part. We'll select the BTRG in-flight viewer. And adjust the ordering within the web part zone so that work list appears underneath the document library. To set up the integration, we start by opening the tool pane. First, We'll select No Chrome to hide SharePoint's title, and then we come to the key element, the PeopleSoft content URL. We need to grab this from the PeopleSoft application, so let's open that in a new browser window or tab. In our case, we want the work list, so sign in with any user that can see the work list link. Once we're in, right-click the work list link, select Copy Shortcut, and head back to the SharePoint page. Paste our link into the PeopleSoft content URL field, then open the Basic Properties group. Check the box to enable single sign-on, then click OK. Once we get out of editing mode within SharePoint, we can see this manager's work list right on the page. Notice that it stays confined to the real estate we've defined for it right alongside the links and the document library. Now let's drill into the work list. The content is fully interactive. We can look more closely at each work list item before acting. The great UI enhancements offered in PeopleSoft 9.1 are preserved in SharePoint. We'll hover over the employee's name here to bring up the business card info. We can also cycle through the other tabs on the component while staying in SharePoint. That's a good introduction to the capabilities of InFlight, but let's look at another example. On the Manager Recruiting page, we've got a document library with specific guidelines for recruiting tasks, and we've also got an RSS feed from another system. To really make this a one-stop shop for managers, we're going to bring in the entire recruiting menu from PeopleSoft. Again, we add the BTRG InFlight Viewer web part to our target zone, and open the Properties pane to complete the configuration. This time, we're targeting the complete recruiting navigation collection, but the procedure is the same. Right-click the link, copy the shortcut, and drop it into the PeopleSoft content URL field. InFlight will handle the rest. This time around, we'll adopt SharePoint styles to take more look and feel from the surrounding SharePoint site, enable single sign-on, and also write out a breadcrumb trail at the top of the component, allowing users to easily get back to an earlier state. Here's the entire menu, brought into SharePoint with just a few clicks. Again, we can hit any of the underlying content and our session will be fully interactive in real time, but stay contained within our SharePoint page. We can make changes now, or return to the menu using our history breadcrumb trail. In just a few minutes, we've used the power of InFlight to create a tool recruiting page using content from both SharePoint and PeopleSoft. Managers get all of the tools under one roof, and InFlight makes the integration simple, strong, and scalable without a single line of code.